call me. <laughs> of course, I left my phone at home today. Uh, got a new project. A guy came in here from uh, Florida. Uh, Troy, thank you, Troy. Um, Pete, and he's got a um, he's got a um, a barbecue store, barbecue supply store in Bartow, Florida. Is there such a place? I think, I think I'm, I'm Bart, sure. Bartow, Florida. They just opened it. He and his dad owned, opened it back in November. And uh, he was talking about a, a, a product because he says, you don't have any W sauce. And he goes, don't you watch the internet? I said, well, yeah. <laughs> I do I said, remember. Was it him and his wife? Or yeah. They came in there. I remember yeah. that now. Yeah. And, and he said that there's this guy named um, uh, Stale Cracker. Have you seen this guy, Greg? Anybody seen it? I, I never heard of it. They'd be supposed to be the biggest thing that's on the internet. Stale Cracker. And he uses this product. And he says it's flying off the shelf. So we've got it. We have got it. And I'm going to let you taste this. Yeah. This, this is, now this is the, this is the W sauce. This is Bear and Burton's, uh, uh, Bear and Burton's Worcestershire. I never can say that. Worcestershire sauce. And uh, I had the, uh, this is the regular. I'm going to let you taste the regular again. And because I want you to talk about the flavors that are in this thing. It's, it's pretty good. good. It's pretty good stuff. It's pretty good. This stuff is, is, is Worcestershire based. It's got onion. Um, you, can, you, can, yes. you, can, you can just kind of feel mm -hmm. the onion in it and yeah. stuff in there. It's got very little sugars, but it's got a little sweetness to it. Light brown sugar. That's pretty good yeah, palate. it's buddy. got a little sweetness to it. Um, love the, the Worcestershire itself. Cane sugar and molasses. Molasses. Gives Diced it a little color. tomatoes. So a little, and there you can you can get that too. It's got a little texture mm -hmm. to it. So It's got a distilled vinegar, salt, anchovy paste. That's that one. I anchovy didn't. paste. That one I didn't get. I've never even tasted an anchovy. Anchovies, salt, and olive oil. Uh, garlic. Good gosh, this stuff's got the kitchen sink in it. By the way, I saw somebody, as a matter of fact, I think it was your sister yesterday, put this on some barbecue and was eating it on barbecue yesterday. Did she like it? I was busy she, when she was. She did. Did she like it? Okay. Yeah. Um, Sorrento pepper mash. Green Sorrento peppers and salt. And it's got a little xanthan gum. I love So this has got a really good flavor. It's got a little zing to it. I I personally do use a lot of Worcestershire sauce on my ribs and stuff the night before. I like that. Mm -hmm. uh, so let, what's this next one coming up right This here? is this <laughs> is the W Bear Bear and Burton's W sauce. And this is the Fireshire. You've got Bear and Burton's W sauce, America's Worcestershire. And then you've got fire shire. So it's gonna have a little heat. No, it. it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't. It all heat. Yeah. I want you to. I want you to throw this back. Yeah, no, no, no. I no. want you to throw that back like it's a shot of tequila. <laughs> no, 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 no. Better have that water ready. Mm. Boom. <laughs> I like. I actually like that better than I do the regular. Because it, it's hot. It's it's not hot to me. It's got a great. It's got a good bite to it. You know, just a really come good. Great. Come here, taste this. You can use the other side of the cup. You ain't, ain't going to Come on around. Come on around back. Come on around. Come on. We got our friend Greg. The uh, Greg's going to uh, Greg the barbecue here. Steve, actually, that's that's not too much heat. That's a really good. He used that size. He used that size. Good grief! He did it. Oh, it's got a lot of cinnamon in it, too. Cinnamon? No, it doesn't. Taste mm -hmm. like cinnamon? It doesn't have cinnamon in it. But it's not It's not too too hot. Too, it's got just a little bite to it. It's got just enough bite to me. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> I thought it burned my head. Habanero peppers, uh, red, red habanero peppers, mm -hmm. uh, jaloca. Oh, you know what I was reading on the other one? I was reading the Worcestershire sauce. This is <laughs> I was reading the wrong one. Okay, this is this is the fire. Okay, this is the fire one. 
Here, hold that. Hold that in mind, Rick. It's got a little texture like you said. Yeah, it's got that texture, which I think is like the onion and, and the tomato. Distilled vinegar, diced tomatoes. Uh, let's see what makes it hot. Onion seasoning, blend spices, including mustard, salt, turmeric, salt, green, green, serrano peppers. Are those hot? Serrano peppers? I don't know. Very hot of pepper. Green serrano peppers and salt. Red habanero pepper mash. There's a little bit of heat. Red habanero peppers. Jalokia pepper mash. B H U T Jalokia peppers. Anchovy paste. Salt, olive oil, and xanthan gum. Okay, so and good. and and here it is. Ghost chili powder. And and that was that you that was good. You're good with that. I like that. I couldn't eat that. I actually that I would put that on my barbecue sandwich. Are you kidding? Would, would yeah. you too, Greg? Oh my god! You yeah, that is really really good. Am I am, am I a? Uh... You could do. That. Thanks, Greg. Am I... <laughs> you could. <do>. Am I? <laughs> Not that. <laughs> But uh, am I am I a, a, a heat panty waste? Well, <laughs> well, I don't know. I did send you some food one time, right? So yeah. that was a little too spicy yeah, for you. Yeah, it made my it made, it made me have mouth sores. Red beans yeah. and rice. Yeah. yeah, a little 